Tony. Oh. It's me, Valentina. You got no reason to be calling me. <laughs> I have to tell you everything. He told me to rub his dick raw with the cheese grater. What? The what? Fuck? what? I wouldn't do it. I told him to fuck off. No. A cheese grater. <laughs> Yo, how do you this come man back is a from menace. that? We not Wolverine. This man is a menace. How do you come back from that? A cheese grater, dog. And then they bring some cheese. <laughs> no, some oh cheese. my God, no, not the mozzarella. F double R, F double R, F double R, F double R. Gotta bring that energy. Gotta bring that energy. How you doing, F Double R fam? If you're new to the channel, welcome. If you've been here, welcome back to F Double R. Friend request reviews with friends request friends to watch The Sopranos season four, episode eight, titled "Mergers and Acquisitions." Hmm. I mean, that's it's plenty. There's plenty of mergers and acquisitions to be had, and and, and and that has been going on. So I'll just say what I'm more excited about is probably being home. Really excited about that because y'all know how I've been feeling about Pauly. He, he's been on some some different shit lately. So it's, it's good to see him out because I want to see where he's going to land. He's still, he's still slithering in the grass, in my opinion. So I want to see how this is all going to play out for him. How you feeling over there, Relic? I'm feeling great, man. I think that's a perfect uh, route that this episode might take. You know, the Pauly route. Because uh, that title kind of fits that situation uh, perfectly. But you never know, man. This so far has been great. I don't know what to expect for this episode, to be honest. Uh, I'm just looking forward to the, to dive into this one, man. So I'm ready. Hey, look. He ready. I'm ready. I know y'all ready. So we ain't going to hold you any longer. We just going to fly right in. Y'all ready to do these videos? Go ahead. Drop your likes. Make sure you comment down below. Most importantly, subscribe to Goal is 10K. Click the button, click the bell, get notified when we go live. Get it, boy. Let's go. Y'all not ready for mergers and acquisitions. How y'all doing? I don't even know what this is going to bring. Episode 8. We deep in it. Episode 8. Eight so great. Woke up this morning. That's my favorite part. <laughs> Besides that. <laughs> Let's get it. Starting at the crib. Made it with a lot of milk and oh sugar. Oh my it's god! More comforting. With the bullshit already. You sure you don't want some eggs or an English or something? What will make me happy is a kiss. What are you still doing here? I thought mm -hmm. you were flying out to Naples. I used to drop off the shirts from Batsy's guy. All right, but you should be on your way to see your old man. I'm sorry, Tony. You're gonna have to get to somebody else to drive you tonight. Not a problem. <laughs> Polly. <laughs> Who is what? You know, a colostomy bag. Furio's old man. Mm. How the fuck would I know that? Can we not talk about this? Or we can talk about any topic you like, T. Good. <laughs> he in his moods. I mean, it's a sensitive topic for him. I'm mean, worried. Hey, I just sit down a perk damn boy. Get a pen of paper. That man's I'm about to write on a pillowcase. All right, you and Sheila, you figure out who pays the Longshore Union, how much. I back you up whichever. Fuck. I know, right? No. It's scary, huh? It's a scary moments right now. No. You just get just feeding her information like just right there on the pillow. <laughs> They're bringing this back. Fucking God. <clears throat> Artie, hi. How are things? Fine. They ever catch those muggers? <laughs> I was just wondering if you had any ideas what Tony and I should do with the proceeds from the property in Newark we sold. I heard. What? The kid loves Paul Newman movies. <laughs> no more grandpa for you. T-bills. I was able to lock you in before the uh, rates dropped. What doesn't this kid know about money? Huh? <laughs> no, I trust him 1,000%, huh? 
That boy locked in, man. <laughs> Carvella know it. She see at least she picking up on he it. He slipped. He slipped. Next year we could put a Oh shit, they bringing this man back. They showing him again. Well, whatever we give them, the girls at our lady shelter should be grateful. I mean, nobody told them to go and have babies with our husbands. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> that it. Mm, I ain't even about to I ain't even about to engage in this shit. <laughs> like, you better not. Good nigga hit the about face quick, like. It doesn't anything ever change? I mean, women are supposed to be partners nowadays. I'm not a feminist. I'm not saying 50-50, but Jesus. <laughs> she said, I don't want to do 50-50, though. Right, right. <laughs> I need a little bit of pocket change. <laughs> Get my red bottoms. At least 70-30. <laughs> Isn't your cousin Brian handling your money now? The big things, the investments. He's doing well, too. You know, I do have to give Tony credit there. He did meet me halfway with that, God bless him, which was a very big step for him, I know. Well, so maybe you have nothing to worry about. I don't know. Tony pulls people into his circle. I don't know what to think. See? I love that conversation. She's, she's seeing it, man. Mm -hmm. He pulling that boy in. He ain't your cousin no more. He Tony cousin now. <laughs> <laughs> fuck this horse whispering shit. Look who the shit. fuck walks in. Hey, that's his horse. Shit. Yeah, he was going to let it die, though. He was. You right. <laughs> Tony, Valentina. Mm, Valentina, right. Tony Soprano. She works in an art gallery. Helping me to enlarge my collection. Mm. <laughs> and this, my Chiquita banana, is pie oh my. I don't see anything. Maybe you need more light. Oh, sh the fuck. <laughs> I can't believe you did this to me. What? It's good luck to step in horse shit. Ask any horse person. It's true. Then why aren't you people walking around all day Man, looking for the, the horse shit to stomp around in? It only works if it's an accident. Fucking sick, all of you. Fuck all. Where's the hose? I ain't even gonna lie, bro. My heart was racing. Because nah, Ralphie be wildin', son. He be wildin', but about not. To, yeah, I wouldn't think he'd I do thought he was about that. to put her face in that shit. Like. You know, it can be risky trusting him to have a sense of humor. See, what he even said is risky trusting <laughs> testing his humor. So if there's anything you need, anything at all, you just press this button. Which one? This one Damn, that I'm showing. She look like she could be Safety his real ma. Friend of yours, Miss Cirillo, might stop by. She said she wanted to see you before you went down for lunch. Look, just like home. <laughs> They're gonna wait on you hand and foot around here. Bunny, put the boxes in the closet. Oh, look how you've grown up, poor me. I know. I don't understand. When I was a kid, you two were old ladies. Now I'm old. And you two are still old. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to embarrass your mother in the dining room. So make sure that she knows she can't sit with me and Min and our other girls. What are you talking about? Oh, come on now, cook. I know you girls can work it out. They really <laughs> so her out better call the soul shit going on here, bro. Bro, they got the politics in the old folk homes. Yo. But... <laughs> Whoa. Hit him with the Keanu Reeves, like. Great, huh? You don't watch movies as a family now. I listen to that. I think it's great. Wait till AJ playing some hip hop on that shit. It's gonna be over. <laughs> it was me they were after. Who are they? This man is a sloppy ass eater. Bruh, bro. straight slob, bro. I need your help, Chuck. Call Bones at the hospital. Tell him to give me whatever help I need, all right? Yeah, he Beautiful go. looking animal. But what about this deadbeat? <laughs> There's no problem cropping you both out. We can set her in front of the rail at the track as she is. Well, I don't know about any of that, but can you leave me in there and just crop him out? Easy. Well, let's not forget to drink to the beautiful senorita whose idea this was in the first place. I bet you say that to all the girls. <sighs> of course. Yep. Of course. Stop for some room service. <laughs> oh shit. She about to prank his ass. She like doing this goofy shit, man. Yeah, until she does it to the wrong one. 
about to find out if it's Tony. <laughs> yep, we about to fuck around and find out. Where, where is it at yeah, on the grass? Hella mad. All that salt on his steak. What? Mine needed salt. Mine needed salt. Ooh. Fucking Christ, he fucking his can't even get this right. <laughs> <laughs> you did this? Oh, that's very mature. <laughs> we will not be mentioning anything about any of this to Ralph. Mm. I'll take it. Can you send it to uh, this person here? Sure. You this. want to put the card with this? Yeah. This man went straight to buy some diamonds for her. Look. He can't he can't help himself, man. You know? He gotta go through the whole cycle. He gotta go through it all. It was great while it lasted. Let me, let me have another one. But he had it sincerely? Yeah, I guess. <laughs> I'll take another card. Are you sure, dear? She hit on the 18. Oh, God, Nucci. How could you hit on 18? These motherfuckers really gambling, gambling, though. I, I, I was thinking there was, like, bingo or something. That should have been my card. I could have had 21. Mm. <laughs> Maybe you ought to play roulette. It's right over there. <laughs> he about to do a prank on Carmella. A little cold water. Yeah, well, it's really unpleasant. Do you remember <sighs> promising me? So you could do it back to me. I don't want to do it back to you. Why not? It's fun. Do you remember promising me? Yeah, so what? So, this is one promise I would like you to keep. <laughs> Man, just one. If you could give me one. Chucky? <laughs> Come here, you pizza face son of a son of a gun. You <laughs> <laughs> son of a son, son of a gun. <laughs> so, did your mom tell you I saw her over at Green Grove? Apparently, she sees quite a bit of your mother. Well, that's just it, Chucky. She eggs your mother on, and she don't even live there. I'm not sure I understand. I'm just asking you to talk to your mom. See if she can include my mom in more with the group. It won't do much good. <laughs> now, you know how these old gals are. Facts. Maybe he clicked up. For all the bad I did. Oh, I'm still capable if I don't watch myself. But with all of that. She always had my back. Fat. All right. Take care, all right? That man really scheduled an appointment for this shit. Like, <laughs> Wow. Dun -dun -dun. Dun -dun -dun. Damn. Yep. Hello, beautiful people. Oh, look who it is. Here we go. Hey, how are you? Member Valentina? Yeah, nice to see you again. Yeah, same here. You don't want to pull that horse shit stunt? <laughs> Everybody know now. You feel me? That shit spread <laughs> wildfire. Hey, for me. Let me see. Oh, uh, I don't know. Give me. Oh, my gosh. Can y'all be any more obvious? I'm gonna go, uh, I'm gonna make a call. Okay? I'm wasting away. Really, Tony, just tell me. How come I can't see you again? Because you fuck well. You got morals all of a sudden? I don't know morals, but I do got rules. Some Dago macho bullshit about don't fuck your friend's girlfriend? Yeah, that. <laughs> After you done already did it. <laughs> Let me tell you what's really going on. He doesn't fuck me. I swear to God, he's some kind of freak or something. No. You two don't have sex. No. Damn, so close to letting that shit spill. Because once that gets out, it's over. I mean... Ralphie already snitched on himself. <laughs> Not necessarily. He brought that shit up for no reason. That shit would have had me like, what? What? <laughs> <laughs> yep. What is she about to do? You about to get dressed? Pull up? This is it, bro. This might be the season she crosses that line, bro. If you ever cross that line. Guaranteed there'll be nothing to save you. That's facts. She finna ride a horse, nigga. <laughs> She's looking at. Oh, she gonna look for the bread. She about to find the bread. She yep. knows exactly where to go. Look at that. Mm hmm.
really think that was gonna work? You know how to smack <laughs> that said, shit. She said, uh, You feel uh, me? Hit it like a mosquito. Yes. Uh. Oh, shit. Yeah. Tony. Oh. It's me, Valentina. You got no reason to be calling me. I have facts. to tell you everything. He just makes me do stuff. Not really even sexual. He told me to rub his dick raw with the cheese grater. The what? Fuck? What? I wouldn't do it. I told him to fuck off. No. A cheese a grater? Fucking... Yo. How do you come back from that? We not Wolverine. This man is a How do you come back from that? A cheese grater, dog? And then they bring some cheese. <laughs> no, some oh my cheese. God. No, not the mozzarella. Maybe you're feeling guilty. I don't see that. <laughs> Why would I? Because he's a friend of yours and you're cuck holding him. Mm, she <laughs> called him a cuck. Yo, that's crazy. Just want to ask you if it's possible for a man to go out with a woman without really doing anything with him. You'll mm. have to be more specific. Exactly. He likes them to hurt him. And that's it. I thought all that stuff was just like a, a run up to the act. That's the case for many people, but not for people with paraphilias. For them, receiving pain, being humiliated becomes in and of itself the sexual release. Wow. Like. No, I don't know nothing about that. I need to be swimming in that water. If a guy like that is going out with a woman, he could technically not have penis every contact with her volleyball. It sounds like you're asking me for personal information. I really can't give you. <laughs> I mean, what's he gonna do with the information anyway? He's like, he about to eat that booty like groceries now that he know he ain't cream pie. It. And now he know he can go full force. Hello. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> Yes, Tony. Yes. You know that ain't the last time. <laughs> nah, bro. We gotta, we gotta root for this man for this one second. Nah, because he's been shit. I'm feeling like Carmella really right now. <laughs> in, uh, the like finances at the home. Um, what is All you gotta do is say some strippers fought at Bada Bing, like, and he <laughs> flew in his pocket, like. <laughs> Is she gonna do the? She about to take the keys on the bed. Is she gonna do the water? No, she about to get the keys. Carmela, you wildin'? Okay, she took a little break, a little half a break for herself. It's no bueno though. There is no more home, ma. We sold it. You know that. I bought Cookie a card from the gift shop downstairs. I cared enough, and I sent the very best. Don't you worry, Ma. I'm going to talk to the social director. She's the one to straighten us all out. See, now he about to go crazy. Look how they got his mob in the bed. Look. Them eyes. Oh, shit. <laughs> no such a cute. He going to bring up Carmella. <laughs> There we go. Exactly. Listen to your aunt. Hmm. Don't be talking like that. That conversation we go. just went left. Bro, I knew that. That. I did, how did I it I should have said this shit, bro. I should have said this shit a couple episodes that? ago. <laughs> what? This nigga Furio about to simp for this puss. Oh. What is going on? What is going on, y'all? I don't know. This shit's so crazy. Pizza shop. Here are four examples of the classic. Oh shit, she about to go to Naples. <laughs> <laughs> That's where she took that bread for. She about to take a little trip out there. Sometimes I think this place is like high school with wheelchairs. <laughs> Tell your mother to be patient. 
<laughs> Things will settle it really down. Is, though. All right. I'll talk to her again. Well, what the hell are you gonna do for us? She doesn't always put her teeth in. The girls don't like that. This is not good. Right. Mm. Also, she's a tattletale. She tells on the other girls for the slightest infraction. <laughs> she's just not very adept at me. Yeah, you see me out there snitching. It's not them, it's your mama. Did, did you get that, Chris? What's going on? Mm, Paulie on his ass. Is it Paulie? Nope, he got uh, the young boy. His goons. <laughs> she running, yeah. Damn. So sorry I'm late. I had to make up this whole thing at work. It's all right. What can I get for you? Avion, whatever. I broke up with Ralph. When? Last night. This shit is too I'm just going to take it. He brought out this leather mask with this funny... All right, all right, all right, all right. Well, I don't think now. I'm a married man. I'm a happily married man with two kids. I'm not going to say I love you. I always say that too soon to guys, and I, I'm trying to work on that, but... It's too late. You just said it. He find you implied them? it. How does he find them? 9,900. Interestingly, at $10,000, we're required by law to notify the IRS of the transaction. <laughs> oh, really? Interestingly. I wanted something safe, something old economy, maybe treasuries. Mmm, she had four different spots. Well, three. She going to the phone. Listen, Jay, can we uh, shut this off for a minute? I got something I gotta ask. Sure. It's a little awkward. Oh, shit. He about to ask about Ralph. Yep. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm trying to find out about his sex life. Mm-hmm. She about to tell him. <laughs> you know it. Come on. <laughs> That's sister. I was pegging his shit. $3,000. Damn, she charged it for five. That it's a number that I thought you'd five. say yes to. Should have said five. He said, you thought, right? <laughs> what have you heard? You pay me $3,000, I'll answer your question. <laughs> the bottom's from the top. I don't even know what that means. What about playing on fucking? I'm telling <laughs> you, he can't get hard that way. And if he could, I don't think that he'd want to. <laughs> Went right oh, back to it. Went. Look at it. Look at it. It's all over his face. Oh, shit. Is he going to notice? Mm, hell yeah. She left it. She shouldn't have left it like that. She is better off taking the whole thing. Yeah, oh, now you going to think somebody robbing his I don't see why I have to do anything I don't want to. I didn't live for 84 years to have to be nice to somebody I don't like. Mm. Haven't I earned that right? Yep. Mmm. Yep. You know what that means, buddy. Is he putting it all together, though? Maybe. <laughs> Throw it on the table? No? Come on, big man. You scared. <laughs> I'm get scared as a bit. You went in the backyard the last couple of days. Me? It's freezing out there. <laughs> All right, I'm going upstairs. <laughs> He's like, something going on. <laughs> you feel me? <laughs> something about to happen. Uh, 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 do it then. You sure, Tom? There's not something you want to talk about? Like what? <laughs> like what? I want you to say it first. <laughs> <laughs> Goddamn music is pissing me off. Mm. Once I hear the music, I know it's over. Yep. It just pisses me off. <laughs> All right. There you have it. The Soprano Season 4, Episode 8 in the books. This one was all right. 
You know what I'm saying? Like we went on a little poly journey. Not the the uh, poly journey I was expecting. I thought we was gonna get a little bit deeper into, you know, how he's been <laughs> over there crying about about Tony and 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 to Johnny. It's kind of funny though. Poly crybaby, just like his mama. Be telling <laughs> and shit, just like his mama, man. Starting, to, it's all starting to make sense now. Uh, and then of course we had Tony doing his 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 Tony things, man. But most importantly, yeah, most importantly, the feelings are blossoming, and dangerous conversations are being had. So. Y'all keep talking about how dark this season gets, and they keep playing with themes that can get really, really dark here. So I'm, I'm, I'm worried, man. How you feeling after this episode, Bradley? You said it was okay. I think it was a great episode. Um, a lot happened, man. You know, a lot happened this episode. That is, yeah, very worrisome. Like, where, where are we gonna head with some of these uh, new, these new details, man? Carmela out there. Acting a fool, Fiorio. Acting a fool. We got a new Vuma. Acting a fool. It's just. It's a lot, man. It's a lot. And I don't know which way we're going to. Which way we going to head, you know? Towards the end of this season. Like, well, which ones are they going to pick? Cause this, yeah, you know, this, focus on. yeah, what they're gonna focus on, like, because we have, you know, this, and then we have all the other shit. Facts. <sighs> we got Chris, we got uh, Adriano with the FBI. Mm-hmm. Fucking June still in trial, mean mugging artists and shit. Like, <laughs> we got so it's still, yeah, it's still, man. All right, what we hopping into first? I don't even want to talk about Tony, Brad. I can't stand this. No yeah, way. I'm. Yeah, <laughs> I, I, I feel you on that. Yeah, he's just a, yeah. he's a piece of shit all around. But I did like that he actually, um, like really had a real conversation to with with, uh, with Melfi. You know, because you he he always tries to kind of like tell the situation for what it's not, you know, like this situation, he kind of just told it for what it was and, uh, how, you know, how he thought about the whole, the whole, uh, Ralphie situation and shit, yeah. which was, uh, I don't know what, what he's going to do with that information. Uh, other, well, obviously he was trying to figure out if he could smash or not, but I, I wonder if it's going to, it's going to go beyond that. You feel me? Is that shit going to leak? And then know, Ralphie man. catch feelings, and then we back to Ralphie and Tony. Like, I, I don't know, man. It's just like, you know, this. <sighs> I'm trying to give it the benefit of the doubt. I'm trying to, I'm, I'm feeling like he just really only got that shit just to, you know, justify smashing and shit. Because, yeah, I don't know. Cause even if he would use it, like I don't, bro, I don't know. Ralphie's such a, he's such an interesting character, bro. I don't know. I don't even know if he would care. Like, nah, he would care. He would definitely. Hell care. yeah, he would definitely care. Everybody would look at him different, Hell completely yeah. different. And you already know how they, how they is. They gonna be on his ass. Yeah, you feel me? That man, Every yeah. Day. Exactly. Especially the way Janice had his ass, pegging him and calling him a bitch and shit like that. <laughs> like, yeah, if they find that shit out, yep, they gonna be like, I remember that conversation you said that one time. Yep, that was you, huh? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. I don't know, man. I don't know. Enough about Tony, though, man. But Fiorio, man, for me. Yeah, that's the highlight, in my opinion. Yes, because that was just. I, I wasn't expecting it to go that route at all for them to for him to first have that conversation with somebody you feel me to say like I you know I love her he actually said those words Thanks. and then not only saying those words the him implying if you want to actually continue this and actually do this the only way it's possible is if you get rid of him. Now, do, do you think that's actually going to be the case? Like, it... Bro, 
Furious. He's he boom bimping right now, bro. He's simping boom bimping at the over nine thousand. And it's crazy, bro, because when this shit first started happening, and I kept saying I don't want to talk about this shit, I don't want to think about this shit, bro. There was a little piece of me that was like, the only way he could be with her is if Tony died. Like, and it's crazy to to hear that shit, bro. Like, cause that's really the truth. And it's, it's really the only way, right? Like, so Furio, he about to. He about to get caught up, man. Cause he talk about he don't think he could resist the urges. He, you know, he already the other episode he didn't even come in the house. Like he stayed out the house and shit like that just to not even deal with it. So, and then she's on, she's with it. That's what's gonna make it ten times harder. It's not like he's, you know, trying to convince her to fuck with him as well. The moment that he lay it down, she gonna, she gonna catch it, bro. Cause she already fed up with Tony. So, yeah, he I don't, I don't, man, I don't think about it, bro. I don't know. And then not, yeah, and not only that, you got Carmella out here stealing now. So, mm. I feel Tony like if she takes, setup, like. <clears throat> if she takes that step with Furio, then it's just like she's in it too deep. I don't see no way out for her, yeah. especially if she get caught. If she get caught. That dark term might be as darker than I've ever thought that it would ever be, but I don't think they could. I don't think they could kill off Carmella. Like, oh no, nah, Tony gonna cry and beg for forgiveness. Nah, he would just kill Fiorio, you know. Fiorio about to cuck his ass, bro. <laughs> Telling you, they <laughs> foreshadowed that shit, man. <laughs> like, said you cucking your friend Ralph now. Fiorio about to cuck you, man. It's <laughs> like, a wrap. Yeah, uh-uh. yeah. That's that situation is getting it's getting bad, man. It is. It's getting bad. It is. Especially since she, bro, she's found the fingernail, so she's liable to. Like I said, she open, bro. She liable to just let it pop. So, and he, you know, he gonna be back next episode, man. He ain't about to be in Italy for too long, nigga. I don't know. He might end up just saying like, "Fuck it, I'm gonna stay here," because he did say. You know, when I saw the motherland from the airplane, I did get a hard on, so. And then he said, after that, it won't the same, though. It didn't feel like home. Yeah, he did he say said, that. said, motherfuckers had litter on the, on the <laughs> ground. <laughs> he said, there was a bag of chips on the ground. They come out of here. Like, ain't, ain't no way in New Jersey any better, bro. <laughs> like, no, there's way more litter. But, yeah, that I don't know. I don't know how they're going to play with it, man. They they made, they definitely did imply and allude. I don't know. It's tough because even if he does do, try to do it, he's gonna have to do it by himself. Like, there's no way you could recruit people to fucking try to just whack the boss just to get his wife, bro. I like, know. And like, how to... do you? What's the process after you kill him? Like, uh, how do we you get into Carmela? Like, you feel me? That you feel? Me? Yeah, like you. Yeah, that shit. That yeah, that's a big one. Because Carmela, at the end of the day. She might slip and give you a kiss or some shit, man. But she she living how she living, bro. And she's seeing all these other wives not living the same. So she ain't trying to lose her cash cow. Not right now, bro. <laughs> <laughs> she only start, She only took a little forty k. She she's got a lot more taking to do before uh, she get rid of this motherfucker. Like, a little forty k, all right. That's a big forty k, forty k, forty k. That ain't shit for Tony. If it was, he'd be stomping like a bull through that house, bro. I mean, he can't make it obvious. And uh, and then on top of that, um, the finding the nail, I think, is what really got him like, damn. Is this Carmella? <laughs> exactly. So then he could be obvious. If he know if he no. think he knows it's her. If he think he knows it's her, nigga. If 40k come up missing, bro, can't just accuse right. her of it. Right. He can't. He can't just accuse her of it, and then you know he could ask just go her. Go on like life, like that just didn't happen. He could ask her though. He asked AJ, "Have you been in the backyard?" Exactly. <laughs> he don't got to accuse her, but he could ask a motherfucking question. That Not boy. Yet. <laughs> that boy. Nah. He just. He, he ain't going to ask her because he looking at it like a payoff. That's what it is. Just like last time when he cheated, he bought her the necklace or whatever and shit. Mm. Like, 
That's all that is. That's the only reason he ain't really going to ask. He was going he gonna to charge it to wow. the game. That's a nice conclusion to that. But, uh... Yeah, man. Uh, where we where we thought the episode was gonna go was with the whole Paulie situation. You know, we thought that was gonna kind of the title was gonna tie in with the whole Johnny and Paulie, but it ended up really just being Paulie, Mom Dukes, and and the old ladies, like old lady gang, the old lady, <laughs> all walkers, man. I. I it's sad, man, that this got this got to happen. Like, my man Paulie just can't talk to his moms. Like, <laughs> that's true, right? You just really have a co- old dude. Like, just have nothing. a conversation. At least let her just put her teeth in. You know, minimum, <laughs> minimum. Let's just keep the teeth in, and then we'll work our way up. You know, tatter tell. Well, tatter tell too. You got to be priority as well, because. You can't be tired of telling we trying to slip a drink or something. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, she over we here telling, to... like. <laughs> little tequila and the jello shots. You like. feel me? They <laughs> like, trying, they trying to get right. She out here right. You can't have that. Like, can't have no fun. We 84 trying to, trying to live free. <laughs> you feel me? Trying to live young, wild, and free, <laughs> bro. You feel me? We out here gambling, playing blackjack. Trying to go outside, smoke a cigar. Like, come on, man. <laughs> That's crazy. That's crazy. Paulie just like his mother. He really is, don't. That fool be tattletelling. Well, people actually like him, though. People actually invite Paulie to the table. <laughs> no, Tony. Tony seems like he, he ain't fucking with Paulie like that. I don't think it's necessarily that he ain't fucking with him, but I think it's that he's trying to make that transition to with, between him and Chris. Like, mm. so he really ain't. I don't know. Uh, I don't yeah, know. That's Tony, Tony. That's nah, because at the same time, Paulie's still the homie though. He could at least, you know, be a homie to this nigga. Tony's just been on some weird shit, bro. Like, he a fucking tyrant, bro. He's annoying. <laughs> I can't lie, he annoying sometimes, bro. Like. Yeah, the shit he do. Crop Ralph out the picture, like, come on, bro. Like, like get take both your asses out the picture, nigga. Like, nah, just crop Ralph out. Just and the only there, reason, like, the only reason he hit girl up in the first place because he was bored. <sighs> I'm bored, so I'm gonna call her, you know, buy a picture and go fuck. Like, facts, facts. Man was just emptying out the lid out his pockets, and, and the business card was still there, like. Yeah. This dude is. <sighs> he trash bag. He fully committing. Talk about he fully committing. We just got over Gloria. We didn't even get over her. We just got rid of her. And then he had the blonde junk. Like he just, bro, this nigga. It's a wrap. Fury about to have Carmela bent over the dining room table, like, and Tony just gonna have a flash of all his gumars, nigga, just lined <laughs> up. Like, <laughs> This is what you did, bro. This is what you brought upon yourself, man. I wonder if we're gonna have like a <laughs> a Christmas pass type episode where he like <laughs> visits all his gumas and shit. <laughs> Yo, that should be sick, bro. He do. He needs some shit like that. Yeah, he, he, we, he we need, need the, a, the dreams again. He need a shroom trip, like facts, facts. <laughs> so he could see all the bagootery he be doing, man. Because they should, they should not about to last. But um, another thing for sure is the whole Chris situation, man. Like, it's it's weird though, cause they, cause Tony, he talking about he back, he gonna back them and all this shit, but he really just he can't let go, bro. He can't let go. Everything gotta be his way, man. Mm-hmm. So that shit is like I don't. I don't I'm gonna just not talk about Tony, bro. But Chris' situation, man, he he tripping, man, writing shit down on pillows and all this other shit. Me. Like I know he don't know about his girl yet. Um, exactly. But I don't know, man. He he's just been sloppy all around lately. Even even with the news, like ever since he's been made, he hasn't really done too 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 much. Like I know you motherfuckers can't just level up immediately and shit like that. But like. <clears throat> He, has, he hasn't really been 
doing the best, man. Every time he got called today, he was fucking sleep, basically. Like, so I don't, I don't even know. I feel, I don't know how to feel about anybody anymore in this damn show. They all looking just ambitious and hopeless out here these days, man. Nah, that's a good uh, observation about Chris being in bed every time Tony calls. Seems like he called in called them in the afternoon and you in bed sleeping so mm-hmm. yeah it's most likely you know the drugs most likely they're both in bed so it's possible um yeah man i don't i don't know i don't know what the dark turn is gonna be is it gonna be chris and adriana is it gonna be tony Fidio, Fidio. carmela <laughs> gonna be Paulie, Tony, Ralph, Lev, yeah, Ralphie. I don't Love know, Paulie man. And, and Johnny, yeah, this, yeah, this, yeah. I don't know. That's what I'm I saying. That's what I'm saying. Cause like the whole, if it slips out about Ralphie, like what, what, what could be said? Like what if specifically what they say is that he was getting pegged and being, you know what I'm saying? That he could turn around and be like, oh, I did that with you. So he goes at the genus. Mm. You feel me? Maybe that type of situation. That's why I was saying like that could be bad news. Like depending on how, what is said, mm. or vice versa, it could happen to to the new chick too as well with her. Like uh, I forget what his name, Valentina. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah, man. I, I, I that's what I'm saying. If it slips out, I feel like that could be another. Another thing that, yeah, could possibly turn into a deadly situation, but yeah. we don't know what they're going to choose, man. We still got, a uh, what, six, six more episodes? It's a, like good, it's a good amount for shit to happen. Yep. All right. Any final thoughts? You just want to drop a scope? I'm going to drop a scope, man. Uh, I get this one, uh. I'm like I'm like right there with it, like close to I'm just gonna say it. I'm gonna give it a I'm gonna give it a nine, man, because nah 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 nah. I give it an A five. A five. <laughs> I thought about it, I'm just like I was annoyed for a lot of it and it was just like uh, but there was like some big things that happened here that could really just turn it to the deep end. But uh yeah, I I'll give it an A five. That's cool, that's cool. I'll give this one like a seven five. Like it was it was alright. Like I don't know, man. I feel like these last two episodes, they just kinda dragging, like they they, they slightly dragging. Like they just kinda jabbing at some of the main shit mm-hmm. and, 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 and playing out the other shit. Like I'm I'm goddamn tired of seeing Tony and his fucking Mumars and shit like that, bro. To be honest, man. I know y'all don't like sevens out there, but this is y'all know I gotta keep it trill with y'all, man. I can't. I can't. Man. This next episode better be fire. Sun better pop off, man. But. <laughs> hey, you speaking too soon. Watch the next episode with some shit. <laughs> like three niggas died first scene and shit. Like, nah, nah, bro. This nigga Fudio come through the fucking windows, G.I. Joe style. Come through like True Lies, Arnold Schwarzenegger and Jamie Lee Curtis and shit. That's my shit, bro. Niggas don't know about that. But, uh, hey, look, y'all heard it here first, man. 7 5, 8 5 across the boards. Good scores, though. You know what it is, man. If y'all still here rocking with us, we appreciate y'all so much. Y'all keep us moving and grooving. Can't wait to get through the rest of this season. I want to see how dark it really does get, man. So, you know what to do, them videos. Drop your likes. Make sure you comment down below. Let us know how you felt about this episode. Most importantly, don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you want more content like this. Also, if you like full link reaction, watch alongs. Uh, we have a Patreon link down below. Don't forget you have to bring your own copy. Don't forget that. All right. Have double R out, y'all. Peace.